on you 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 have to get to start with Taz Hurt. Um, do you know you got to start putting up points right away, or did the game just come to you? No, that was that was one of the things that I've really been focusing on here the last uh, couple games, just letting the game come to me. Last thing I want to do, especially in you know the offense, that I mean, there's there's more freedom now, um, but we're trying to stay away from having the ball stick in, in guys' hands, and so I really wanted to just get it moving the night. Um, I had I had a couple open looks, knocked them down early, and then kind of got in the flow from there. Next is Cody Nesper. Sean, when you when you're hot like you were tonight, and um, you know you had that other game earlier in the year. Is there a point where you where you know you're going to be hot either pregame or in the first few minutes? Um, big thing, big thing is when I mean seeing the first shot go in. Um, but really, it's just I mean kind of feel. Um, I felt really good. Body felt really good. Um, I was just excited to play. We knew this was a big game for us um, on the road, um, especially after the game that you know we had with them back at our place. Uh, we really wanted to come here and get this one. Justin Jackson, we'll go to you. Hey, um, Sean, obviously a, a big win tonight, but I'm kind of wondering now, I mean, the way you guys have kind of set yourselves up here, I mean, you guys have kind of overcome adversity th through most of the season. Obviously, you, you guys overcome a lot tonight. Where does this put you for the rest of the season now as far as, you know, the, the story that you guys are writing? It's huge. Um, we got, I mean, there's, we, we're two down, uh, two and oh, we got, I mean, considering the bailout. So I'm not really sure how the rest of the season is going to play out, but that's that's kind of how this whole year is going. You just – you take it day by day. Um, I mean, if we play Baylor at the end, I think that was our next – our next – no, we got one at home, and then I think we would have won on the road. Um, but that's just kind of how this year is going. Uh, day by day, you can't look ahead. You just got to enjoy the moment, play present. Um, and just the fact that we're getting to play right now with, with this crazy, crazy season and crazy time right now um, is a blessing. So I think that we're all just kind of – Excited, and I mean, especially now we're kind of making a little bit of a run here. We're kind of hitting strides. Uh, I think, you know, when it's when it's best here in February, um, going into tournament time. So hopefully, we can keep progressing. Uh, if I might, I'm just kind of wondering: Do you guys believe that maybe there's something special with, with uh, this bunch that you guys have now? Absolutely. I think that if uh, if you don't think your team is, you know, especially this time, you know, going into you know middle of February, uh, coming up on March. Um, just the way that we're playing now, I think is is unique. It wouldn't. I mean, obviously, we had some things uh, go on here earlier in the year with with Oscar, but um, we all wish him the best. But I mean, now we're just playing kind of a different style on offense. It's it's open a lot of you know different looks for for guys and just playing with more freedom. You know, Deuce is able to make plays and create. Taz is able to do that um, as well. And then you know, I mean, we just got a, a bunch of guys that can score the ball. Um, and then Derek is obviously a, a huge threat inside. So it, it's nice the way that we're playing now. We've got a chance to be really special. Kevin. John, obviously you had the threes, but it looks like you've really been developing the up fake, putting the ball on the floor, driving it into the lane. When did you start working on that? When have you been gaining confidence? You feel like you can unleash it now about any time? I did it uh, a lot in JUCO. Um, and then when I came here, just kind of got labeled as a shooter. Um, first year jitters last year. Um, all I kind of really did was shoot. I didn't do a whole lot off the bounce. Um, did stuff here and there. But this year, just playing a lot more relaxed. Um, I knew I had it in my arsenal. Um, but it's just confidence. I mean, seeing the ball go through, um, I, I knew that I could put the ball on the floor. And especially now that team scout, um, you know, lately here. I mean, it's kind of been a roller coaster of a year. I've had games where I shoot it really well. And then um, I think now it's kind of getting more consistent here in the last two weeks or so. Um, but yeah, I mean, especially now. Um, Teams are, are starting to run um, when I get the ball. So just one, one pump fake, go by, um, get to the rim, score the ball, do different things, look for my teammates. So so it's good. The offense we're running now is good. Go ahead, Mike Kazaza. Hey, Sean, um, if you just kind of go back to when you turn the calendar to 2021, everything you guys have been through from, you know, players leaving, players getting hurt, you know, comebacks um, that come up short, comebacks that go all the way, COVID pause, I'm going to run out of breath here trying to rattle all these off, and tonight's just more of the same. What what have you seen from guys, the coaches, your teammates, a look in people's eyes? I don't know that kind of maybe explains or how you guys have hung around and won these games and, and, and not not fallen down yet. Relentless. Uh, we got guys in that locker room that, that want to play basketball, um, and that's just simply what it comes down to. Um, I mean, COVID, guys leaving, guys getting hurt, 
guys being sick. I mean, you like you said, you name it. Um, it's just that next man up in town. Like tonight, I mean, I was starting and things happened. Not starting. Taz is having some issues, so I step in. I mean, that's just the mentality that we got to have. And then <clears throat> the guys in the locker room, they all want to play. They all love playing. Um, so that's just kind of, you know, the, how we're looking at it and how we're taking it now. And we'll finish up with Skylar Callahan. Go ahead. Hey, Sean, this, this is a type of game that maybe a year ago you guys may have not pulled out, especially on the road against a really good team. Uh, what, do, what do you think the biggest difference is from where you guys were last year and the road struggles to this year? Biggest difference? We – I mean, I, I mean, we all say it, but the guy, I mean, especially now, it's just so, this year is so unique. Um, and it, it's just really tied our team closer, I think. Um, and we just, I mean, we go out there, I, I would do anything for those guys. I would I would take a bullet for those guys. And I know they do the same for me. So especially now at this time, um, we're just trying to win ball games. We're trying to do everything we can to win. Um, I think we're playing better basketball too. So it, it's kind of going hand in hand and it's good.